Welcome to Nova Videos. A link creates a relationship between two or more properties in a procedure. Welcome to the Nova software. Links are essential programming tools provided by Nova. A link creates a relationship between two or more properties in a procedure. Using links, it's possible to create procedures in which command properties are adjusted in function of the command properties. So for example, the hydrodynamic procedure. You go to library, then you select linear sweep voltammetry and hydrodynamic linear sweep. In the commands, you will see in some commands that these are linked and the link you can see on this chain symbol in the command line. You can visualize this link by selecting the link button in the right upper corner. This procedure contains a repeat command, configured in the repeat for multiple values mode, like this in the rotation speed. So the, each repetition will change the rotation speed and we start with 500 RPM. This repeat loop is connected to the setting of the rotation speed. You can see that in here. And this is how you create a link. You have to select both commands with the control key. So you hold your control key and both commands are now selected. And when both are selected, you can create a link. The rotation rates required for the measurement are predefined in the repeat command. The small chain drawing symbol in the bottom right corner of the repeat command indicates that this command is linked to another command. This means that the properties of the repeat command will be used during the measurements to adjust the properties of another command in the procedure. So this is how you create the links. We can also create links from scratch. So just open psychic voltammetry the standard potential static and then we can add a message box in this message box we can add a value asked for input for example um, we can say start potential start potential potential and the message is fill in the start potential then we can give it a, an initial value let's say 0 0.3 volts and this start potential you can uh, link with the control key holding the control key to the apply potential and you can make a relation with this link so the value now we can add to the potential which we're going to apply and each time we modify in the message box the value let's say to 0 0.7 it will automatically adjust also the applied setting as you can see here this applied voltage we can also now link to the command of the procedure of the cv so again we hold the apply button and then with the control key, we can select also the CV staircase. And now we can make a relation with the link as well. So the potential, we can link to the star potential. This way you can see the relation between all these properties. You see the star potential in the message box, apply potential, and the star potential in the CV staircase. It's also possible to edit or remove links in the procedure at any time. To edit or remove links, it's necessary to open the edit links screen by selecting one or more linked command and clicking the link button. For example, like this. And then you can remove links altogether.
it's also possible to reroute existing links by clicking one of the ends of the link and moving this to another anchoring point. The link is moved from the start potential, for example, to the stop potential. So from the start potential, I can move my link to the stop potential. In this way, you make a relation between the commands. Well, I can show you also another example, a real example by selecting LSV. LSV, and I create a repeat loop. Let's say this one here. I put my LSV inside of the repeat loop. And now I'm gonna make a relation with the scan rate, for example. So I'm gonna make from multiple values. Let's say from 0 0.1 to 0 0.5. And five rotation of uh, scan rates at range. And now we can link this range to my scan rate of my LSV. Again, by holding the control key, I can select both commands and then I can create a link. So parameter one is my scan rate. I'm going to link it to the scan rate in the linear sweep voltammetry. Now the values are linked. The only thing I'm going to do is adjust a little bit my procedure and um, I'm gonna increase the current range and also the plots I want to see my I versus T plot in plot number one. Also I don't want to wait for five seconds I'm gonna only wait for one second. So the moment I press start you will see the influence of this linking. So we start at 0 0.1 volt a second of scan rate and the procedure automatically adjusts to 0 0.2 volt a second, 0 0.3 volt a second, 0 0.4 volt a second and 0 0.5 volt a second. So you don't have to manually change the scan, scan rate in this way. Thank you for watching Nova videos. If you found this Nova video helpful, please like and share with your colleagues. You can subscribe to the Metrum Autolab YouTube channel so you are notified when new videos are available.